Hi everyone, today in math we are solving problems by finding equivalent ratios. We are going to use this scenario and we're going to use tape diagrams as our visual for the ratios to help us solve the problem and make sense of it. So this first problem, it says when Carla looked out at the school parking lot, she noticed that for every two minivans, there were five other types of vehicles. If there are 161 vehicles in the parking lot, how many of them are not minivans? So there's a key right there that at the end we're looking for not minivans. But the ratio that they're talking about, it says for every two mini minivans, there are five other types of vehicles. So my initial ratio of two to five, two is minivans and five is other vehicles. So I'm going to do MV for minivans and OV for other vehicles. So for my tape diagram, my minivans are tape diagram, the ratio is represented by two. My other vehicles or OV is five. One, two, make it a little bit longer here. Two, three, four, five. Now it said then the entire parking lot there are 161 vehicles. So the 161 includes the part of two minivans and the part of five other vehicles. So there are seven parts total and those seven parts total is 161 vehicles. So if here is two and here is five and total together is 161, I want to take 161 and divide it by seven to find out how much each one of these little squares equals. So how many sevens can I get into 16? Well, I can get two sets of seven. So above the 16, I'm gonna put a two. Two times seven is 14. When I subtract, I have two left over, which is good. So I can bring down my next number and I have 21. How many sets of seven can I get out of 21? Three of them, because three times seven is exactly 21. So I have nothing left over. Now that 23 tells me that each of these squares has to represent 23. And I'm filling this one in because again, the question had said, how many are not minivans? So I know that each of these are 23 as well, but these represent the minivans. So the other vehicles are the ones that I'm concerned about of not minivans. So I have 23 times five, three sets of five is 15, carry the one, two times five is 10 plus one more is 115. So we have a total of 115 other vehicles that are not minivans. And there's the answer to my question. So once you use those Venn diagrams to get, or not Venn diagrams, but the tape diagrams to help you see the visual and look at the problem again, see what it's asking, then it makes it a lot easier to solve the problem. I hope this helps. Good luck with your practice.